people in the place to be. What's going on? It's me. It's me. Let's not fuck around. ID four two. That has to be probably ID four two. The trailer just dropped officially, and it starts right now. Two minutes later. All right, party people. Uh, I don't know how I feel about that. I first of all. I was skeptical when I heard that they were doing a second one anyway, because I'm like, the first one was so good, I don't think they need a second one. They told the story, it was a good story, they don't need a second one. Alright, the story that they're coming back, okay, that I guess could make sense, but I wasn't sold on them doing a second one. And this doesn't help quelch my uh, insecurities on a second one, because it looks CGI'd uh, to death. The first one... Did practical and probably had some CGI. I would imagine, of course, they had to have some CGI in it. But it wasn't CGI to death. This looks like it's CGI to death. It looks like the trailer kind of reminds me of the Fantastic Four trailer with this, how they did the space stuff. And that's not a good thing. <laughs> it's not a good thing to make me to remind me of a shitty movie uh, that nobody did or wanted to go see um, just in the past year. Uh, they brought some people back. I like pop for Judd Hirsch. I've heard that the black kid who's not Will Smith is the kid who's supposed to be Will Smith's son or stepson or whatever from the first one. Uh, okay. <laughs> Goldblum's back. Okay. I'm not, I'm not sold. I'm not sold. I'm not sold on this. The, I don't know, the scenes look like other movies. You know what I mean? Independence 4, or I, ID 4, Independence Day, didn't look like other movies when it came out. It didn't look like any other movie. It t it looked like it took place primarily on Earth, which was a which was another good thing uh, about it, another different thing about it. This one looks like it takes place primarily in space, which is fine. But I I'm not a huge space movie dude. I'm not a, I'm not being like ah oh, I gotta see what they do with space. Like that meh eh meh meh for me. Uh, some people aren't like that. Some people love space, and that's cool. I'm like, okay, space is cool, practically, like here on Earth, but like, I'm not, I don't get my Jones up for space movies uh, in general. So I don't know. I don't know. I would say off this trailer, out of my $15, this trailer probably earns, uh, probably earns, Seven and a half of my fifteen dollars. It doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't move the needle much for me uh, in one way or the other. So I don't know. Uh, yeah, it, it, that first one I wasn't like completely blown away by it. Tell me what you think about it, party people. Like it didn't. I don't know. It didn't. It didn't make me want to see this movie anymore than I already did. So I don't know. Maybe another trailer might get me into it, but. For me, I think the balance between Earth and space isn't there. It seems like it's almost all going to be in space, which it wasn't in the first one. Like, I don't think they did much space. I, if I remember correctly, they didn't do much space fighting in the first. Like, it was all they were trying to invade here. And I don't know. It, it, it doesn't move the needle for me. Part people doesn't move the needle for you. That's what's most important. If it does... Let me know down there in the comments section. Like, share, subscribe. Go to YouTube.com slash Surreal469. Click the little blue button over on the right-hand side that says support. You'll be supporting. And new development. Go to ReactorsUniverse at gmail.com. And vote for your boy, Surreal469, as your favorite reactor of 2015. Hashtag Top Reactors 2015. Top 20 Reactors 2015. I think is a hashtag. I'll put it up somewhere. Yeah, hashtag Top 20 Reactors 2015 helps support that way. And that, part of people, ain't bad. Boom. Boom. Boom.